symmetrical, polytechnical, primordial, orbital, cerebellum, take me to Nirvana, piloting Vamana, Krishna, consciousness, amidst chaos, obnoxiousness, God, child, supreme being, know what patterns mean, feather crown, never bound, by confinement, to thoughts of violence, out of darkness, came the true design, do away with time, through the mind, understand the lotus bloom, then the mind can bend the spoon, spiritual cleansing, time and space bending, gravitational lensing, observe matter, wave interference, electrons, change in appearance, serotonin, released from the cortex, manipulated DNA, tornadic vortex, complexity of the Vinci weaponry, stand with the seraphim, to the return of the Nephilim, burst firing, reaction to the novelty, shed aside the bodily, see the grand scheme, fluoride lobotomy, at war with the dominant conglomerate, do away with the negative and repetitive, my control acts as a sedative. Unified field extending, cleansing, prophets, optics, mending psychotropic thoughts of Coptic, crusaders which favor a Christ-like nature, greater than all right dogmas, taught by fathers of the Amorites, guided by the Ambalite, spied by the supreme green gleaming and seen Elohim dream machine, bringing string scenes, string meaningful beams, the polarized isotopes, through wide souls, gods who recite the notes, from the Kashyyyk archives, revised by the guardian scribes, rise above from Ardian tribes, parts of men reply to the most high, blessings descending with the never-ending evolution. Mending resolution with the mystical frequency, which is free to all dimensional seas. Produce numinous experience, reducing communion with ethereal deities. Appear in threes like the square root of nine, staring to the common's eye. Recruit the challenge mind, climbs divine meridians. Fabulous philosopher's stone, turn cities into thrones. Pacifist paradise, perpetuator, magnificent awareness, device, perfect attunement. Healing anger, recite highest vibes, breaking physical walls, splitting walls, and locked the prisons into all Babylon's great falls. Surpassing all kings, powerful and tall, beyond all others, violent, splendid, a wild bull of a man, unvanquished leader, hero in the front lines, beloved by his soldiers, the fortress they called him, protector of the people, raging flood that destroys all defenses, two-thirds divine and one-third human, son of King Lugobanda, who became a god, and of the goddess Ninsa, he opened the mountain passes, dug wells on the slopes, crossed the vast ocean, sailed to the rising sun, journeyed to the edge of the world in search of eternal life, and once he found Utanabishtim, the man who survived the great flood and was made immortal. He brought back the ancient forgotten rites, restoring the temples that the flood had destroyed, renewing the statutes and sacraments for the welfare of the people and the sacred land. Who is like Gilgamesh? What other king has inspired such awe? Who else can say, I alone rule, supreme among mankind?